been a minute since I posted a video and I figured if I'm gonna make another video I gotta go all out so today I'm gonna be changing probably seven I'm gonna be changing seven of my piercings today and I'm gonna show you how I do them and just talk through it while I do them. the first ones I'm gonna do are my second and first and I'm gonna do my industrial I've had this jewelry in for like two years so yeah I got some really cool jewelry and I can't wait to show y'all how it looks so let's get started and now that I finally got some new jewelry for them I'm excited and it goes with it goes with my new lip piercing it's the same type of it's a um citrine same as the one I have on my lip you see it yeah. This is the jewelry. These ones I got, oh no, my ear don't like these. Think I might be allergic or something, but have my ear echo. No. Yeah. This third one I have, I'm gonna leave that in. This is the um, video I made on my channel where I pierced this one. I still got it in after all this time, so that was successful. Yeah. The second hole, I'm gonna do just a standard hoop. I just had to change that one out because my my ear was not reacting too good to it. It's just a standard hoop. Right? And then I'm gonna do the same thing on this side, so stay tuned. I finished putting the jewelry in on both sides and this is what it looks like. Now, let's do the industrial. This is the chain industrial thing I'm about to put in. It's just gonna go across my ear. It's gonna hang down so it's gonna look like this in my ear, but this is what it looks like. All right, now I'm gonna show you me taking it out. This is a little different. I have to take this one out for each side. Actually, no, no I don't. Oh, it comes out like this. Yeah, this is really old. Look at this. This jewelry is really old. I've had it in for two years. It's probably outdated. I don't think they sell this anymore. This is what my ear looks like with no jewelry in it. It has a hole like right here and there's a hole at the top. So, how I'm probably gonna end up putting this in is through each side like this. Finally got it. Ah, I'm gonna put this one in because it goes with the jewelry. So let's try this again. I usually don't like putting in these kinds because it doesn't have a plastic ball at the end. I'm gonna just try my luck. We're gonna see. All right, here I go. Next, I'm doing my septum piercing. Change it to this really rad ass little, you know, clicker. I usually like don't wear clickers too often because just keeping them in and having to take them out with a bobby pin and all that shit to get it out of my nose is a fucking hassle. So I just, I don't really like clickers that much, but this is a clicker. A clicker is when it pops into place like this and it snaps. Here it is. This is a clicker, but it's like one piece like this. Ain't it cute? All right, step one, take out old septum. <laughs> All right, hold on. Ah, this is not exactly easy. Taking out septum jewelry isn't easy, and neither is putting in septum jewelry because these tiny ass balls they put on them. It's in. Now I just have to snap it into place. Snap. That one didn't hurt. All right, so the last one I'm gonna do is my belly ring. So this is the nose ring I currently have in. And if you wanted an update on that second belly ring I did, here's your update. I took it out. This is the scar. Isn't it, isn't it gnarly? This is the scar I left. I'm sure if I put some tea tree oil and some water on it, I'll be cool. This one is like a little dangly one, similar to this one. what it looks like so now i'm done changing all my jewelry and i really like how it all turned out it's cute 
thanks for watching my video and stay tuned for my next video i'm not sure what it'll be but just stay tuned thanks for watching Peace.